YouTube, it's Mai here. Welcome back to my channel. And for this week's video, I'm doing another blindfolded drawing challenge. So in my last blindfolded drawing challenge, which was me trying to draw Bob the Minion, if you guys want to go check that out, link will be down in the description box below. But in the last video, I asked you guys who I should draw next, and someone requested Mickey Mouse, and I thought that would be a perfect idea. Mickey Mouse is a very well-known character. He's popular almost all over the world. Plus, he was like like literally my childhood so I know him very very well and you guys also should know Mickey Mouse and if I mess up you guys will definitely know that. There are many poses of Mickey Mouse but I will be drawing a certain pose that he likes to do it's this one right here. But let's not further dawdle and get straight into the video. So since I don't have a proper blindfold I'm just gonna be using my night mask so let me get that on. All right, I'm completely blinded. I cannot see a thing. So where's my Sharpie? Yes, this is it. So since I'm blindfolded, I'm not going to be doing pencil and then outlining it with a Sharpie because that would be pointless because I can't see my pencil lines. So I'm just gonna start right off with Sharpie. So to start off Mickey Mouse, I'm gonna start off with his head and work downwards. So Mickey Mouse has these big old round ears that everyone knows him by. So we've got one right here, and then you got another right here. And then his face curves down like that, right here, and I'm guessing this is where his ear is, and it moves down like so. And then I'm gonna give him his little cute round nose. And I'm also gonna give him that big old smile. After all, Mickey Mouse has one of the greatest cartoon smiles. And give him a little tongue. And now I'm gonna give him some eyes and some pupils. So Mickey Mouse kind of has a tan face and then he has this sort of black outline on him. So the black outline on his face will be right in the ears and then it'll curve downwards right on his face and there. And that'll be the black outline. So let's start with the body. So you can't really see his neck too well in this picture, but you've got kind of the base of where his body is. So this hand goes out like that, and then his glove, here's his thumb, and it goes down like that, and he has three fingers, and it goes back inwards, and he's kind of puffing his chest out a little bit in this picture. Let me do the other side. He's got this arm, the thumb is out this way. And his hand is facing right towards the audience. Got his three fingers. And then you've got his body. And then you've got his sh big old red shorts. So you've got one short and another short. To make it a little more 3D ish, I'm gonna add those circles on the bottom. And then you've got his legs and those big old yellow shoes that he wears. And then on the other side, and I'm just gonna make sure that I left the part where his glove and his arm meet. You've also got these little white circles on his shorts and a little crease for where his toes are on his shoes. And of course, you can't forget his tail. So I'm just gonna go back and make sure I added everything, like the glove part, where his legs are, and how the shorts go around. And there we go. All right, now that we're done with inking, we're gonna get onto colored pencils. So these are where my colored pencils are. Oh, 
these are all of them. Okay, black. Which one's the black one? Oh goodness, where is my black one? I believe this one is the black one because I remember sharpening the black one a lot, so it's really, really short. Okay, Mickey Mouse's body is entirely black, so I'm gonna start off with his head again and go around the ears. And then go to the side and do the other one. I'm probably not even anywhere close to the ears. I have a feeling I'm not even close. <laughs> so then you've got that part where it meets his face. Okay, now let's go down to his body. So there's his somewhat neck and his big old puffed out chest. Oops, something fell. And here's his arm. And his other arm. And then I'm gonna skip this little part here because I think this is where his shorts are and those are red, so I'm gonna skip that. And then I'm gonna color in his legs. There's one leg. And the other. Make sure I filled in everywhere. And of course, I've gotta color his nose. So, let me just find it and color that right in. Okay, I think that's it with the black. So, let's move on to the red. Um, I don't remember which one is which. I think this one is the red. I hope it is. It's probably not, but let's just say it is. So, let me find his shorts. Do the outline. Oops, and I want to make sure of those circles. I don't want to color those in. Those circles will remain white. Luckily, there are a few parts on Mickey Mouse that I don't have to color in, like his gloves and the two little um, dots on his shorts. Oh, I feel like this is the yellow for his shoes. Ugh. Okay, let's pretend that was red. I really hope that was red. Okay, now I'm gonna do the shoes. So, I think this is the yellow. Whoa, geez, I really hope this is the yellow. This is probably the red. <laughs> That'd be really ironic. Okay, just do the outline. Oh gosh, this feels so much like the red. Oh no. That's okay. These things aren't meant to be perfect. Oh jeez, I feel like I'm not even like... Ugh. I will get better with time, I promise. Oh gosh. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna make this part right here a little bit darker because that's where his toes are. Give a little shading here. And do the other one. I just realized I'm being so quiet right now. I'm, I'm not trying to be. I'm just trying to focus and like concentrate on drawing this. Even though it's probably not turning out how I'd want it to be. But, you know. <laughs> it's like a motorcycle going by. Oh, jeez. Okay, that was his other shoe. All right, now to do the last few things. I think this is the tan color. I feel like this is the pink for his tongue. This is the tan color, I hope. Because I, I think the tan was another small color pencil. So let me find his face and color that right in. And be mindful of the mouth. 
and the eyes of course. Okay, I feel like I'm not coloring in the face, but you know, mistakes happen. <laughs> Oh jeez, this probably looks so weird right now. Uh, <laughs> I know I say that I'm gonna get better, but since I'm blindfolded, I really don't think I am. This is probably why most artists are blind. <laughs> okay, let's pretend that was his face. And the final part is his little tongue. So I'm just gonna draw that right in. Okay. And since his gloves and his um, little white dots on his shorts are white, I'm just gonna keep them. Okay. Now, since I've done everything- oh wait, wait, wait! I have to do one more thing, I almost forgot. I have to sign it. This is my sharpie. Let's go to the bottom. Let's sign it. Okay. Oh, I should put the date too. What's this? Today, this is, I'm gonna put down the date I'm actually doing this. Today is the 30th. Yes, I recorded this on a Wednesday. Okay, so now that I've done everything, it's time for the reveal, and I'm so scared because last time it was really shocking, and this time it's probably gonna be really shocking too. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Oh! Oh, wow! Oh, oh, yes, this is... A masterpiece did I not even use the yellow like what happened here oh oh dear 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 oh you know what I did I used the yellow for the nose oh my <laughs> the, the mouth is where the voice goes off oh my goodness I did not even like get any of this I, I drew him so small too Oh, pants? I knew- I knew the shoes were the red! How come his pants are it? pink? Oh dear, that, that that was supposed to be the tongue color, and these are supposed to be the shorts, Why do you and the- the tongue so big? Nose is supposed to be the shoe color. I got the black right, but, um... Why do you make the tongue so big? No, the tongue's not supposed to be that big, it's just I used the wrong color. Oh my goodness. I drew him so small. <laughs> like compared to I have the Bob the Minion one. Like compared to the Bob the Minion one, <laughs> it's so much smaller. And a little but, better. A little. You know what? I did get a little bit better. I did get better at the drawing part. I just the, need to master the coloring. The, name thing, right? the coloring is what I need to master. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Well guys, that was this week's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. How do you like uh, my uh, creation? Mm -hmm. But I find it so funny that like I knew I was coloring with the red, but that didn't stop me. I don't know why, but I just know what coloring with my red color pencil feels like. I know that sounds really, really weird, but like my red color pencil just has this feeling to it that I know that I was coloring with the red. But you know, you know what I did get right? I did get the black and the face color right, I just didn't color them in the right position. To be honest, I'm actually getting better at the drawing part, like the inking, but I still gotta master the whole coloring thing, which will probably take a while. I am really sad I drew him so small, but you know, I guess I wasn't really thinking. <laughs> but anyways guys, like I was saying before, if you guys enjoyed this week's video, then give it a big thumbs up and comment down below what you thought. Also comment down below another character you guys want me to draw in my next blindfold drawing challenge. It doesn't actually have to be like a specific movie character, it could just be like a creature. You never know. And always remember guys, when you are in the spotlight, strut your stuff. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys in next week's video. Bye!